Hi guys, we're back making a new recipe that I'm very excited to try. Um, it is a cilantro lime marinated chicken. I'm actually going to take you back a few hours because I've been marinating my chicken for about two and a half hours. You can do anywhere honestly from like two and a half to like six hours. I probably wouldn't do much longer than that depending on how old your chicken is. Um, but I did do two and a half hours and I'm going to show you the ingredients you need, how to prep it. Honestly, once you make the marinade, it's really just grilling the chicken. So I'm gonna bring you back to that now and then we'll go back up to speed and we'll do what the actual grilling looks like and I'll show you how I'm pairing it with two different kinds of meals. I'm gonna do a bowl, like a chipotle style chicken bowl and then another one with a salad, um, just swapping out rice for salad. So I will bring you guys back in time now. of my ingredients I've got an entire batch of cilantro I've got two limes a tablespoon of garlic and then I've got about two and a half pounds of thinly sliced chicken breast and then I've got all of my seasonings pepper sea salt paprika onion powder cumin chili powder and then I've got some olive oil so I'm just going to put everything inside my food processor so I'm gonna put my entire batch of cilantro even with the stems on in there and then I'm going to put in my garlic so we're gonna do onion powder, and we're gonna do one teaspoon. So now that I have my marinade, I'm just going to put it into a baggie with all of my chicken and pop it into the fridge for anywhere from like two to six hours, depending on how much you want the flavor to soak into your chicken. So I'm setting aside probably like two tablespoons of the marinade just to use as a little bit of additional marinade while I'm actually cooking the chicken and the rest of it is in my baggie that I'll mix up. I'm gonna pop this baggie in the fridge now that it's all mixed up and I'm probably honestly gonna only do it for like three hours because that's about all the time that I have um, but you could do it a little longer if you'd like two hours later okay so now that you're up to speed I have pulled my bag of chicken from the fridge and I'm already ready to go this is probably the easiest recipe in the entire world because all we're gonna do is pan fry it if you do have access to a grill honestly it'd probably be bomb to grill it on a grill so you should try it um, and let me know how it is, but I am going to do pan frying. Um, just a quick tip, if you are new to meal prepping, my number one tip is like, if you're already making breakfast, lunch, and dinner, just make more of what you're already making because it's the same amount of effort. So like marinating, what, six or seven chicken breasts, it was the same amount of work as if I just did one. So just double or triple your recipe to start and see what you get. So we're going to turn on our grill to medium high and I'm just going to put my chicken breasts on it. Okay, so I just pulled everything off the skillet and I just laid everything down on a cutting board so that it could just cool and I want to make sure everything was totally cooked through. And now I've made all my bowls, so I'll show you what that looks like. And then I'm going to take that little bit of extra marinade that I had that I did not marinate with the chicken. Um, that, the one that we like set aside and I'm going to just add a little bit of that on top to every single piece just as a little extra dash of flavor.
This is what the final piece looks like. So these, this one and this one are my bowls. And then this one is more of a salad. Uh, there's just a tiny little bit of rice on the side. And then this is also a bowl just without corn and beans. And then this is all of the extra chicken I made, which wasn't really planned, but I ended up with a lot more than I intended. And then I've also got more sides of rice to make meals with later. It smells amazing. And honestly, this is probably like gonna be like seven or eight meals for me, which is super great for this week. If you guys enjoyed the meal prep, please give the video a thumbs up because that's how I tell what you guys like, what you don't like, so let me know. Um, I'm going to dig into my meal because I'm so hungry and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!